Aloha, it's Dr. Gupta. I just got the best message from a friend. She told me that her seven-year-old, after I visited with them and talked to her seven-year-old about her teeth and flossing, she went into her bathroom that night and she flossed and brushed on her own. And she flossed, I don't know if it was the first time, but it's not a regular habit for her at all. And you know what's funny? I've been talking to her mom about flossing like every day, every time that I see her and it doesn't make a difference. So you know what I've learned? Sometimes you have to skip the parents and go straight to the kids. I think kids are so eager to learn. They listen so well and they understand and it's so much easier to make those changes in their habits. And also us as parents, we're overwhelmed. Sometimes we just don't have the time. We feel so tapped out. So the best advice I can give you is talk to your kids, talk to your friends' kids, talk to your patients if you're a dentist, talk to the kids, they are so smart. My little one, I taught him at two years old the importance of flossing and he's never forgotten. And these kids are smart, they can learn and we can create sustainable changing, we can create sustainable habits, good habits for these kids by just educating them. So cheers to Good smiles, healthy teeth, less cavities, and happy flossing month of 30 days. I don't know what day we're on now. I'm 